welcome to Southwark. We are walking along the cut, first of all, on our way towards Lower Marsh. And the reason we're here today is because we watch Simon Calder, who does an Instagram live travel report every Saturday and Sunday at half past five. And he came to Lower Marsh a while back and I thought, that looks like an interesting area. Let's go and take a look. So that's what we're doing today. There's lots of interesting places. Look, Marcus, this is the Young Vic. Is this the place that you were talking about? Yes, when Simon Calder did his report that day, he walked past the Young Vic. I'm not sure if he went in or not. Did I it look busy? It is, uh, what, when he did it? Okay. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know, because it was dark. But um, I think it's worth investigating. Okay. Well, it is a bar, but it's also a theater. Now, you may have heard oh. of the Old Vic. Well, this is its younger sister. I don't actually know if they're related, to be honest. Maybe but not. I'm sure you could look up online to see what performances are on while you are watching this. And it's not often that we start an episode by <laughs> having a drink. So we've still got a lot of things to discover along here. We only had a half pint, yes, you may have it, noticed. It was small. Yeah. I was just saying to Paul, I don't know if you've ever noticed this, but if you get a pint, it seems to take quite a while before a you get to time. the half pint level. But when you get it half a pint, or does it? But for me, when <laughs> I have a half pint, it just disappears like within minutes. Strange, isn't it? Look, Paul, we have just been to the Young Vic and there is the Old Vic. Oh, wow. Which is another very famous theatre. And at the moment, it looks as though there is a performance called Just For One Day. Mm. Wonder how long it's on for. One day? <laughs> it looks like we are approaching the area called Lower Marsh Market. I think this is a really vibrant environment and it seems to have lots of um pastel type of colors like a bit of um neon or neon blue and um light pastel pink so i think that these are really nice contrasts So here we are, Paul. We have arrived on Lower Marsh. I think that this seems like it's a really diverse environment and it has a lot of multicultural foods. And what I would say is, it, in a way, it kind of reminds me of Camden yeah, a little bit. However, that. there aren't the crowds. We're here on a Saturday afternoon and you would think that Saturday it, yeah, afternoon. You would think it would be absolutely rammed. But it isn't. There are people around, but not a lot. I don't know, this could almost be like a hidden gem. Oh, look at this. It says fun, food and drink. Oh, look, it's Vaulty Towers. Well, we would like to go in, but it does seem to be quite busy in there. I think so. Yeah, but it's very eclectic. Uh, there seems to be... Colors. Yeah, there seems to be some sort of like model or like a creature or something hanging look there's legs there but you can sort of get a little look in from here maybe that's why it's quieter on the street because everyone is in vaulty towers yeah. 
What have you spotted? I see some creatures. Creatures? What sort oh. of creatures? You know, cuddlies. Oh, right. Oh, look. There seems to be a lot of interesting stuff in here. I see a bear and a bunny rabbit. A teapot? Yeah. Slippers. Do you know what we need? We need a tin opener. I wonder if they would have one in here. Probably not. Oh, oh well. Paul? Yeah? Paul, isn't it weird? We have never been here before. We have never even heard of this area. I don't come to Waterloo. But look, that's Waterloo Station. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just there. And yet this area just exists at the back of it. And if it hadn't <laughs> been for Simon Calder, we would not have known about it. Oh, look over there. I see a big... Happy, healthy Waterloo sign. Got to go and take a look at that. So it seems that this is a health centre. What a magnificent way to decorate it. So one of the places that Simon Calder mentioned when he was here was Marie's Cafe. And apparently it's an institution. So we are hungry. And if it's possible to get a seat, I think we should probably go in once we actually find it. Yes. I don't know if it is. Look at this, Paul. The Scooter Cafe, cafe bar. Okay. Oh. Look at the old bar sign. Wow, it's fabulous. And look, there's also the Wing Loon Cafe. So maybe we might want to try that out. I like the look of this hotel. It's called the Stowaway Apart Hotel. It's a fabulous looking building. So it seems Marie's Cafe is down at the other end where we came from and where we will be going back to, I think, possibly. But I need to eat. Yeah, and we're going to have a look at Wing Loon Cafe. You said they have Ho Fun. Yeah, look. I oh, there it is. Stir-fried Ho Fun. Yeah. That's not bad. I say I need to go in. Two, please. <laughs> Well, that was lovely, wasn't it, Paul? It, it was very, very quick, too. It was, and we were the only people there. Now, while we were in, I did look up Marie's Cafe, and it turns out that it is a Thai restaurant. What? I had this idea that it was like a greasy spoon cafe, oh, right. and that we could go in for a coffee or something. <laughs> but no, so we've just eaten, so we're going to give Marie's a miss. But I also thought, Surely Valdi Towers is a pub as well as a restaurant, so shouldn't mm -hmm. we give it a second look? Let's do that. Welcome to New York, the city that never sleeps. And I hope that you don't fall asleep without catching our YouTube channel. It's Paul and Marcus, so why not hit the subscribe button below? Thank you. I do like the way that these buildings look with all these outside decorations especially these vases and also those colors
Well, that really was a great way to end the episode, I think. And it wasn't even that busy after all. Just, it, 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 it just, just looked as though it was. Yeah. So if you are in this area of Waterloo, why not check out Lower Marsh? Because you never know what is around the corner. Now, before we go, Paul has a message. Thanks for watching our YouTube channel today. For those of you that have liked it, hit the like button and then it will light up. But especially, please subscribe because it really does help our YouTube channel. Yes, and we are looking for growth this year, as they say. So we will see you next time. Bye. Ciao, bye. Da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da